the time for violent revolution is now. Patrick Matthews recorded this video as he made plans to trigger a violent race war in the United States. Derail some trains, kill some people, and poison some water supplies. Matthews is a former Manitoba reservist with explosives training. He was exposed in 2019 by the Winnipeg Free Press as a recruiter for the neo-Nazi group The Base. After RCMP searched his home, Matthews fled to the U.S. and joined other members of the base at paramilitary training camp. They discussed the opportunity to start a civil war at a gun rally in Virginia in January 2020. But infiltrated by an undercover FBI agent, they were arrested just days before. These men sought to divide our community based on hate and through acts of violence and terror. Today's sentences, though, make clear that their hateful efforts failed. This expert says the case sends an important message. The fact that there was an informant involved um, and the fact that these arrests were successful, these in, the convictions were successful, is a win in that sense. At the same time, it also illustrates just how large this threat is. But Matthew's defense lawyer says he'll likely appeal, while his mother maintains her son is innocent. He made poor decisions based on his age and feeling vulnerable, and he lost his support system. Patrick Matthews told the judge he made a mistake in falling in with the wrong people. The judge told him he was lucky to be apprehended when he was, because if he'd followed through on all that talk, the sentence would have been much higher. Karen Pauls, CBC News, Greenbelt, Maryland.